Good evening. We'll get to that story in just a minute, but we begin with breaking news from Halava. Honolulu police have blocked off Piikea Street after a utility pole came crashing down. It landed in front of some parked cars. You can see the utility lines on top of a car. Right now, there are no reports of any injuries, but police say wind knocked over the pole. Let's check on just how windy it is and will be with Kamaka Pili. Kamaka? Well, Kathy, the winds have been breezy across the state. Looking at current conditions right now, here in Honolulu, at least registering at the airport here in Oahu, only 8 miles per hour. Lanai, higher elevations, 23 miles per hour. Now, in the area of Halava, where there's a lot of different mountainous terrains, the areas below the slopes as the winds come down also pick up speed, so that could have been a factor in why there's stronger gusts in that particular area than there is at the Honolulu airport. But actually, just after the six o'clock broadcast we did have that high wind advisory that got cancelled and actually replaced by a high wind warning and that's for the slopes of Mauna Kea and Mauna Loa along with their summits now that's 50 to 75 mile per hour sustained winds with gusts up to uh, 90 miles per hour now all of these winds are coming because of strong northerly and northeasterly winds from a high pressure system north of our islands that along with some low pressure systems flanking both ends of the state are creating those winds to even pick up higher speeds and create more gusty and breezy conditions. Stay tuned to our KHON2 News at 10. We'll have more later on in our newscast. But for now, Kathy, back to you.